to record the sound directly, you will need a cable called 3.5mm jack to 3.5mm, which can be purchased at pound stores or eBay for cheap as £1. Once you got that cable, plug it into your headphone jack of your device, to the computer, into the audio input port or the microphone input port. Then go into your sound settings for Windows, type start, then in the search box, search for the word sound. Click on sound card settings and click on recording tab. There you should see recording inputs. If you do not see this option, then right click and click show disabled devices. If there is a device you're looking for, then enable that device for recording. If you still do not see any recording device, then you probably do not have an audio input on your computer. Therefore, you need to purchase a USB sound card which has an audio input recording. I suggest this USB sound card to buy off eBay which I already have for more than 5 years. It can record input, audio input up to 2 channels at 16 bit 48 Hz. I highly recommend getting the sound directly from the device using the cable for better quality and more like a real instrument sound. If you're using a Mac operating system then you would need to go into audio MIDI setup and do the same procedure as Windows like enabling the input sound recordings. Now I will show you how I record the sounds from my smartphone to the computer software using the line in recording input on my sound card. You can also use this method with any instruments or any device you may have which has a headphone out jack. I will be using the app Walkband. As you can see I have plugged in the 3.5mm audio cable into the line input on my sound card and, the, and into my phone headphone jack. So the sound is being directly transferred into the sound card to the computer. So if I go to sound settings on Windows, I can see the line in and I'm going to go to properties and you need to go to listen and check this box. Listen to this device. If you want to set it as a default playback device, you can do that. But if the sound is not coming out, you don't hear any sound. Even when you plug in the headphones, you have no sound. Then you need to choose whichever uh, speaker output device you have. You have to choose that one to get the sound out. Normally, you should leave it on default playback. So if I turn up the volume, you can see... One second. You see... You see the bars on line in, the sound is working. So I'm going to go into Audacity and uh, in audio Audacity, the default inputting device will be selected as your microphone and you want to change it to line input device. Line in USB multi-channel. Check that box, then leave everything as, as it is. Then click record and now I'm going to play the sound. I have played it now. I'm going to play it back.